Hey guys, welcome back to another horse ranch episode. So as you guys can see, we have Jacqueline all made over. I did take a cute photo of her while she was on the rocking chair earlier, and I thought it was so adorable when I posted it. I'll put it on the screen if you guys haven't seen it. Today, I did have other plans, but the boys decided to go to work. So I wish that when they were coming to stay over, they didn't have work to go to because that kind of ruined what I wanted to do. So we might have to hang out with them a little bit later on. I did go ahead and have Mallory do her task for work, which was to write a blog. But since Kit and Javier aren't around, I think we're just gonna take a moment and have like kind of a little mother-daughter day and head over to one of the other areas we haven't been to in Chestnut Ridge. So oh my God, look how talkative she is. <laughs> we'll have like a little, not necessarily a beach day, but kind of like, I guess, I don't know if it's considered a lake. Maybe more so a river. Actually, before we go, let me show you guys. So we have another matching chair, which means that our little office area has gotten a makeover. I think it feels really cute and cozy. It's not fully decorated, of course, just like every other room in the house. It's still being, it's still going to have other things added to it. So next order of business is most likely going to be living room and kitchen. And then I also forgot about our little gift from her dad. So he said, you know what, I wanted to give you a housewarming gift and he ended up getting us a washer. So we have a whole new setup in the bathroom. So we have that happening over here. And then outside we have our clothesline she's really excited about that but we're gonna head out because it's already three o'clock and the time is zooming by <laughs> every time I play I feel like I don't have enough time to do everything I want to do within the time so basically there's a little river which also we have a cute little rainbow going on over here but we have this spot over here I did try and place a picnic table but I don't think I can make it work I don't know we'll see <laughs> everything's like in the ground so I don't know uh, if this will be functional. So we'll have her come down here. I did have them bring their towels so that they can go ahead and lay out. And hopefully Jack will be able to wade in the water. I don't even realize it actually even has signs that shows that there's some water here. Oh, look how cute that looks with the rainbow. I love that. Hopefully we'll be able to put down our towels. And this is, who is this? Don Gooseman. I don't think we've actually, have we introduced ourselves to him? I don't think we have. Go ahead and introduce yourself. All right, let's change you into your little bathing suit. Okay, well, he's making some food for us, I guess. Is she gonna go into the water? Where are you putting her? What the? Um, right. Can you place these? Place in world. Oh, you can't? Wait, so the toddlers can't interact with this water? Oh, wait, play in open water. There we go. Now it should work. Oh, there you go. All right, so it does work. Well, now they can bond a little bit. I added one through the lot and I wonder if we'll actually be able to have her, okay, no. So it won't work. Oh wait, yes I can. Let's see. So I guess maybe she can't place it, but I can do it with tool mod. Oh. <laughs> right. Her legs just go into the freaking sand. I mean, it works to an extent. <laughs> it looks funny though. But at least she's enjoying her time in the water. She does have her toy. I wonder if we could have her play with that while she's here. I wish it wasn't such like a drastic slope down. I wish it was a little bit more even. Oh, she's eating the burger. You should probably eat a burger too because you're hungry. Well, I guess we have... Dawn to thank for giving us some food. Oh, she she really wants to have her legs inside the ground. Okay, cool. She No, she's sleeping. She's like, I really need to rest. <laughs> she's just floating up too. <laughs> Actually, maybe I could have put it right here. Oh, see, that's more like it. There we go. Don't know if this is very safe, but she's fine. <laughs> there you go. Now that I have her as a toddler, I kind of don't want her to age up into a child sooner, but I feel like I need to. There's no way they're still at work. Do they even work that late? I don't think so. We should probably be heading home soon. It's already getting dark. Well, at least we were sorted for food. <laughs> we don't have to worry about her cooking or anything. Oh, a new family dynamic supportive. Would you say Mallory and Jacqueline have a supportive family dynamic? I would say so. 
She's so talkative, I can't get over it. Like, she talks so much. Did she get a quirk that was talkative? She got little singer. She keeps trying to sleep in a bush. No, girl. Like, how is it already nine o'clock? Like, didn't we just get here? I can ask her if she wants a sibling. Does she even understand? <laughs> Pick her up and we'll go home. Okay. So I was actually thinking about aging up Sunflower in this episode. Just because I sort of want her to be an adult horse for a little bit before Jacqueline ages up. Because I was going to have them age up at the same time. But I think it'll be okay if I age her up slightly sooner. I believe there's an age up treat that we can buy in town. So we might do that tomorrow. But we actually have our bills to pay. So we have to pay 855 simoleons. Which love that. We love bills. And we also have some mail too. Oh, we got a toy. Tomorrow morning we will... Hopefully be able to go with Javier and Kit to... Maybe we should do it now because I think this is gonna be my only opportunity to actually be able to hang out with them because they probably will be going to work tomorrow um, and I'll be able to cancel it. So what I'll do is... Oh, he's taking a bath. I'll make a club. Okay, we're gonna have them all come here. Let's show you guys how it's done. You know what? This is actually probably good for your frustrations, Javier because you're feeling really angry. You can stomp some grapes with those feet. Oh, you're smelly too. Love that for you. All right, guys, this is where we're gonna make some nectar together. A little family bonding. So let's go ahead and start the gathering. I think it should start working. I don't know if it'll let them, but listen, I'm gonna start crafting some nectar. So it'd be wonderful if you would get in here I wish I could control them. I mean, maybe they will. Or not, you know, it's fine. <laughs> just watch me do it. Well, that was a flop, so... I guess it's just us. Me and you, Jacqueline. Megan Nectar. Oh wait, Reese is coming through, though. Hey! How are you? Share some photos. Maybe we should share the goofy photo of Sunflower. <laughs> he's like it's so funny <laughs> he's feeling flirty oh they're hugging listen we won't say no she has actually been thinking about potentially asking him out on a date because she sort of like has a little crush on him if anything we could probably plan to maybe go on a date tomorrow and then maybe have like denise take care of jacqueline because Kit and Javier do leave tomorrow. That's kind of sad, but I can't really do much with them anyway because, like, I can't control them, which sucks. So, <laughs> as much as I'd love to be able to, like, be more interactive, I feel like next time I'm just not even going to do a proper stay over. I think I learned my lesson to just not do stay overs unless I don't really plan on controlling Sims. Otherwise... I'm not a fan <laughs> of it. Okay, so she's drinking now. And you're just playing in trash. Cool, cool. <laughs> And you are rocking in the rocking chair. Ooh, the lighting here is kind of nice. Look at that. But I was going to take a picture, Javi. Why? Oh, the way he's looking down like, oh, is that what you wanted? Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay, well. Oh, hey, Denise. Did you make this? Let's just call everybody to meal, I guess. Since Denise is awake making food, might as well, right? It's crazy that there's constant awkward encounters, though. I don't understand that. Oh, wait. They gained a sentiment. It really means a lot to me that you make time for me. Just wanted to let you know. All right, so we learned that he's loyal. Maybe we should go home. It's 4 o'clock in the morning. We're not even letting them sleep. We're going to pretend that it's not about to be 6 o'clock in the morning and they're just going home. <laughs> We're all home now. Thankfully. Sorry. Oh, these two are just slow dancing in the kitchen. Cuties. What is your wrist doing? She's twisting and turning. Mallory's boss was happy with the work she did from home and she made 351 simoleons. Oh my god, wait. Or nectar. It's poor quality. Well, that kind of sucks. We're still gonna age her. I can control them now? Oh, is it because their vacation's over? Oh, they're grabbing their suitcases. Wait, why can't we say goodbye? Look, he's leaving. Are you? Wait, why aren't you leaving? 
<laughs> You're just gonna stay here forever? I'm still getting negatives, even though I deactivated her social bunny account, so I don't understand why it's still happening. Like, even if it's deactivated, you can still get it? Like, I don't... I don't know. So Javier is still here for some reason, so I'm actually going to take this opportunity to have Mallory get up and go over into town to see if we can buy an Egypt treat for Sunflower. And that way, Javier can go ahead and just watch over Jacqueline for a little bit. Alright, let's go to... I guess... Oh, we can sell items here too? I didn't even know that. Let's go here. Horse Egypt treats. A hay flavored treat that can be fed to a foal or horse to instantly age them up. It's 150 simoleons, but you know, it's worth it to me. And that way we can also start working on even having Mallory start riding a horse instead of us having to wait however many episodes it will be before Jacqueline. I mean, it shouldn't be that long. I'm expecting maybe next episode we'll have Jacqueline age up, so we'll see. Okay. All right, let's call over Sunflo- <laughs> What? What was that? Are you good? <laughs> I only caught that at the last moment. Blue. Bottle feed, give her some it. attention, and then we'll be able to uh -huh. give her her age up tree. Oh, love. Yes, come on, feeding. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> love glitches. You're not gonna be a fool anymore. Are you excited? What does that even mean? It says full, like at the top. It says full and then Philly. What is that? Is it because it's if it's a female full, it's called a Philly? Or does that mean something completely different? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know anything about horses, so. Are you ready to age up? Wait, we should invite over Reese for this, actually. Wait, he's nearby? Of course you are. Of course. Because I feel like, you know, he's been around Sunflower enough that I don't think he'd want to miss out on her aging up. You know what I mean? <laughs> there we go. Okay. Now let's do it. Feed age up treat. No, Reese, watch. Oh, she booped the snoot. Oh. Look at them watching her. Oh, as he just disappears. Are you not? Okay, she is. Who is this? Oh, look at her. She can now be ridden, trained, entered in competitions, and can mate with other horses. Hooray for Sunflower. Oh, look at you. Oh my god, you're stunning. <gasps> Actually, I do want to change one thing about her. The hair around the hooves that I think looks so cool that I do want to add to her, so I'll probably go in and do that. Oh wait, this is- oh, this is the horse that we saw before, I think. Is this the Kim Kardashian wannabe? Junko Allison? Listen, I don't even know where you came from, but hey, I guess. This is a boy? Yumi Wada. No, it's a girl. Oh my god, you guys can be friends! Oh, oh, we're just rolling on our back now. Okay. All right, let me head into create a sim. They're called feathers. Yeah, I love that. Well, at this point, we should probably add some outfits for her. As far as riding, oh my gosh, she has a little cowboy hat on. Okay, we're not gonna do that. We might do this, a little bit more of a neutral style. We could do something like this for every day, or it could be a second every day. I think I wanna have nothing for her like first one. Then we can have this. I feel like we could do a little flower crown for her. Oh, maybe we just do yellow for sunflower, even though those are not sunflowers. There we go. Sunflower. Something that would have been really cute is if you were able to plan like a horseback riding trail or something where you could go with another person who was also on horseback and you guys could go together like next to each other. I feel like that would have been such a cute idea for like a romantic date, especially if Reese and Mallory did something like that together. I would have... Oh. I would have loved that. We can start practicing mounting and riding because, well, we're obviously not experienced in that, but we just leveled up to level six of temperament, which it says, Sims will now be able to seek emotional support with Sunflower, which will help them recover from being sad more quickly. Let's go for a relaxed ride. No, Mallory, we just got on. 
honey, you're oh. fine. You're fine. Just go for a relaxed ride. We're actually gonna have a race. Try and take care of Jacqueline for a little bit. Let's see if she gets stranger danger from him. I hope not. Yazub. <laughs> Bimbus. Oh, she likes him. That's good. How are you doing? Okay. You know, a nice chill ride. This is the start. You'll get so much better. I mean, I feel like no matter what, Jacqueline's gonna be the one that's gonna be riding Sunflower probably majority when she gets older. We'll have him go ahead and pick her up and help Mallory out a little bit. I mean, he already helps her out with Sunflower, so go and give her some food. He can't, like why? All right, Jacqueline, well, you're just gonna have to eat the animal crackers on your own. And then you, can you refill the animal feeder? Is it gonna take money from me or from him? Oh, you're just gonna poo right here. Nice. Oh, and you're just gonna work out right in front of it. <laughs> cool, cool. All right, go home now. We have to go plan our date. So let's go talk to Reese about it. It didn't take my money. Oh, he's so nice paying for our hay. Let's invite over Denise. Do you wanna uh, hang out? Zuli, Zuli. Yes, okay. Listen, I'm gonna go quickly get ready, go freshen up real quick, and then we'll head out. He said he wants to take Mallory cowpoke dancing because he did give her a little bit of a lesson here last time that they had dinner. And so he said, let's take you officially down to a spot in town and we can do it properly with more people around. Change your outfit and we're gonna do our official cowgirl fit. Okay, so we're actually doing a take two of the date because I just tried to play through it and it was going nowhere. It was terrible. And I think the reason is because of her fear of being judged. I looked it up and somebody else said that they were having the same exact issue. So I'm going to get rid of it because she every time she talks to Reese or to Denise, she they constantly have awkward conversations, which makes it so much harder to develop any sort of relationship with them. So we're going to do... A nice little date and hopefully this time around things go smoothly i don't know if i'm gonna keep any of the stuff that just happened because listen i was about to rage quit <laughs> i'll be honest so let me send them off to the wonderful dance hall that's in town all right so we've arrived at the dance hall this is bill is actually so stunning like look how good this looks are you kidding me but she's getting some chips first because she is hungry right now. Where's she going? Oh, she's gonna go sit next to him. Sometimes they just completely ignore the other sim. Oh, she is completely ignoring him. <laughs> I was like, yeah, it's so cute. Okay, well, can you go over here and sit? You could have taken your chip. Okay. Oh, that's interesting how you just did that. Everybody cross your fingers that we don't have any awkward encounters, you know? So... Okay, small talk, gotta start off small. Oh my god, wait, it's working. It says pleasant conversation. Let's see if we can start flirting with him. Calm in his appearance, if we can, please. Who is? <gasps> this is a big moment, I will say, because I've been struggling. <laughs> okay, this is a success. This makes me so happy. You guys don't understand. <laughs> They're like, why are they just flirting? Yeah, I know, but like, with what I've been dealing with, <laughs> this is big. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sure you sound great, but right now is just not your moment. All right, let's get back into it, shall we? But we also want to like talk and get to know him and all that stuff as well, so it's not just full on flirting only. But this is definitely a plus. We did come here to go dancing, so there is that. But I do want to at least get a little bit of a romance bar before we do that. Last time I did this, he full on denied me, so. Oh! Yes, come on, Reese! Guys, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> that my game is actually working. Honestly, Reddit sometimes is such a lifesaver when it comes to. I know you guys are dancing to this. Why are you here? Denise, you're supposed to be babysitting. At home? This must be your twin then. Denise Holt, because what is this? Girl, none of this. We're not listening to her. Ah. Cowpoke group dance. Let's do that. Let's just get everybody all in here. Okay, there we go. 
Now they officially have gone cowpoke dancing with a bunch of other people. <laughs> I was hoping that we could have gotten like everybody to do it together, but because I don't know everybody, it's kind of hard to, so that's okay. But then we have Denise in the back, who should be babysitting our kid, but is here, you know, it's, it's whatever. We're just gonna pretend she's not here. <laughs> Girl, listen, not only do you sing bad, now you're like invading my personal space, please. <laughs> Give me some room to breathe, jeez. Okay, anyways. We can slow dance. Go slow dance with him. Yes. Do they have any romance yet? They have very slight romance. They became good friends. Great. Oh, he's excited. Now we're on an official date. Let's get into the flirting. I actually kind of like this setting a little bit better anyway. Oh. Okay, so we learned that he's a horse lover, which we are definitely not surprised about in the slightest. That's for sure. We can have our first kiss with him. Not him going cross-eyed, shit. I think we end this date off on a kiss. I'm just saying. We gotta socialize a bit more with him and then... Because I want this to be like a good date, nonetheless. Deep conversation. Oh, that's exactly what I went to do. I feel like him being so generous and helpful definitely put him on her radar for sure. And let's not forget the first time that she saw him at the Steel Vineyard and he was just shirtless, you know. It was a nice sight to see, to say the least. But Mallory definitely wanted to let Reese know how she's feeling and to see if the feeling is mutual, which obviously we're seeing that the romance is brewing on both ends. So she's definitely ready to open a new chapter in her romantic life. It's two o'clock in the morning, so let's go ahead and embrace. Be like Little good night hug. <laughs> Our first kiss. That's the date. I think it was pretty successful, nonetheless. Oh, she got a gold medal. All right, good night. It's time to go home, go to bed. To be honest, I didn't even think I was gonna have a good date at all, but I'm glad that someone else posted about having an issue where they were constantly getting awkward encounters and. If anybody else is experiencing that in their game, that is the solution. Get rid of fear of being judged. That is the biggest issue here. So I think that, oh look, she's laughing in her sleep. That's because the day was so good. So I think this is a good point to wrap up the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm glad that we got Reese and Mallory finally together. I know it might be a little bit quick, but I kind of want to speed things up a little bit, like I've mentioned. So yeah, thank you guys again so much for watching. If you did enjoy, don't forget to consider a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys in a video very soon. Bye guys.